but it, I feel like it's one of the things that's really, really wrong with the with the spirituality industry and the coaching industry. And yes, spirituality is an industry. Okay, it, it's so many people in those industries um, cause the the people that they're supposed to help to feel like there's something wrong with them, to feel like they're they're uh, to feel ashamed, to feel shame because they're not ready for a specific step for whatever reason. You know what? I'm sorry. None of us sitting on this side of the computer, you know, or desk have lived your lives, right? And that's why I'm, I'm always like, I want to see you. I want to see you move forward. I want to see you be happy. I want to see you be successful. I want to see you make the money that you want. I want to see you um, have the relationships that you want. And I don't know personally what your definition of that is. I can't tell you what that what it is for you so that by having all these things, it's actually going to be meaningful to you. I don't know. I'm not walking in your shoes. It's not for me to choose. And it's not for any other, you know, spiritual teacher or personal development guru, coach or otherwise to tell you. That's for you to figure out. We get to guide you so that you can get the clarity on it. But that's it. And that's why I'm never going to sit here and say to you, oh, this opportunity is here. If you don't take it, you're going to ruin your life forever because it's freaking bullshit. That's not true. We, it, it, it's either you, you live in an abundant universe or you don't. And if you live in an abundant universe with infinite possibilities, there's always another opportunity. 